Now to more breaking news tonight, a horrifying scene inside a D.C. public library. A man stabbed and killed another man while terrified patrons looked on. This happened around 730 tonight inside the Petworth Library on Georgia Avenue in northwest Washington. News Force Jackie Benson was the first reporter on the scene tonight and talked to a man who helped stop the suspect. D.C. police officers led the man identified as the suspect from the Petworth Library not long after the fatal stabbing, which happened about 7.30 in the first floor computer area. His hands were handcuffed behind his back. Officers searched him before placing him in a transport vehicle parked on Georgia Avenue. He was not wearing any shoes, only socks. Investigators took away a number of items in evidence bags. Executive Assistant Police Chief Ashan Benedict says the suspect and the victim knew each other. This also appears to be a targeted attack. Uh, the two individuals appear to be experiencing homelessness. They're unhoused. They're known to each other. Uh, again, a targeted attack. One individual walks into the library, follows the other in there, uh, and proceeds to stab him in the neck. Joseph, a student at the University of the District of Columbia, says he was at a table on the first floor studying for midterms when he heard a commotion. I saw the, the gentleman doing this motion. I thought it was being, I thought someone was getting punched or something. So that's, that's when somebody said he has a knife. As terrified library patrons reacted, parents grabbing their children, Joseph says he knew what he had to do. Another man joined in to help. That's when I like, I said, I got to stop and help out. That's when I went and stopped and, and, and tried to help out and then pinned the perpetrator down on the floor until, uh, until the police came. Police praised the actions of the two men who secured the suspect until they arrived. After watching the video, they intervened. They stopped this individual from continuing his attack. They disarmed him. Uh, they held him until police arrived. Police have not identified either the suspect or the victim. In Northwest, Jackie Benson, News 4.